right now, Fowl. I think you should be called the Parfessor because all this do young man does is rack up par. Parfessor. I love that actually. Dude, oh, oh, he's the Parfessor. He's the Parfessor. Let's go. And if you're looking for collaborations, try and reach out. Now we reached out to everyone. Now we're relying on you to write a comment down below because we're not from Kansas City. We need the comments down below to make update videos on this channel. And more importantly, we're going to come back and celebrate a updated video. So let's swing on into the top five public golf courses that you can play out Oklahoma City. I've never been. I drove through it. Never played golf. I look forward to driving through and stopping and playing at some of these courses. So let's swing on into number four, James E. Stewart Golf Course. It's got a 4.4 4 out of 5 on Google. That's pretty legit. And it's got 300 golf reviews to choose from. Uh, this course is located in downtown Oklahoma City, so it's got a little bit of loving neighborhood feel to it. But the course got some history that we have to talk about on this channel. And that's what we love on this channel. It's named after the politician and activist James E. Stewart. And I think this was one of the top courses so far. Built in 1999, it's not that old, but ooh, does it pack a pound. Well, now we're looking at the top four courses, so let's swing on in to our number fourth course here, Lake Heffern Golf Club. Now, situated in Oklahoma City, it's got a 4.3 out of 5, but it's got 400 and 45 golf reviews to choose from just a ton of golf reviews and it's just a fun course man i tell you what there's two championship 18 hole golf courses to choose from and that just really includes a three hole or a par three golf course but really if you were to look at that north course there and that's the one that's the pride and jewel with 6,970 yards with a slope of 128 and a rating of 73.7 of course is a par 72 but the rich history being built in 1951 I think this is one of the top golf courses in Oklahoma year in, year out. And we know on Golf Advisor, it's been rated number two in 2017. Well, believe it or not, we still are just slamming through this list. And as we continue to, it's really rest assured, this, this is going to turn into a Reddit-type feel. People are going to watch. They like the maps, but they're going to read your comment, and they're just going to get excited about what this course is that we missed on this channel. But... With that being said, we need to take a look at now the top three courses throughout Oklahoma City. So swinging into number three for golf course. It's got a 4.4 4 out of 5 on Google, but it's got 117 golf reviews to choose from. So it's a good amount to kind of verify and analyze that this is a top golf course within the area. Now what makes it so special is it's one of those fun neighborhood exciting golf courses stretching 6,601 yard with a slope of 129 and a rating of 71.8. It has been built in 1958 by Art Jackson, famous golf designer. Well, I <laughs> can't believe it. We still have two more courses to take a look at. If you cracked open the wine, well, you just got there in time because now we're looking at our number two or second golf course early wine golf club we love good cheap puns and it's a cheap golf channel so subscribe down below and this one is a 4.3 out of 5 it's got 365 golf reviews to choose from so a good amount but what makes it the best golf course so far on this list and it's just not the name well it's a public course stretching 6,511 yards with a slope of 117 and a rating of 71. It was built in 1976. It hosts pretty much amateur events, more local events, and uh, it's Floyd Flyer designed the course back then. It did have some major updates in the 2000s that pushed it over the list and then brought us into number one. Well, now we're here. Now we're here at number one, and we got Lincoln Park Golf Course, one of those municipal courses that you just can't not add on this list, and also causing some controversy, one would say, on the list, because more importantly, it's just a game that we're going to get things wrong along the way, and we need your comments down below. We continue to play golf throughout the area, so this has a 4.6 out of 5, but it has 517 golf reviews to choose from. It's hands down the best public golf course within the area. It's got a little bit of, you know, museum historical feel to it. It stretches 6,600 yards. It's a par 71. The championship hole is number one. The west at the course is 
probably the better course to play. And it was built in 1921. And with all that rich history by Art Jackson, it's hard not to put it on our list at the number one course. If you made it this far, subscribe down below as we continue to play golf throughout your area or maybe an area you're visiting. This is Professor, and if you're not watching, at least go play some golf.